everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jess or the TIE Fighter Chick. Today I have a Circa 1955 box to open. If you're unfamiliar with this company, or if you haven't been hanging around my channel for a bit, um, they are a Disney-inspired candle subscription service. Nicole, the lady that runs the company, is absolutely amazing, and I don't know if you can tell by looking at the box how, like, this thing is stuffed full. Um, I have not had any spoilers on this box. I don't even really know the theme other than just looking at the box. It looks like celebrate, uh, cheers to five years, a celebration box of some sort. I'm really excited to get into this. I love the gifts that Nicole includes with these boxes. So let's crack into it. Um, if you're wanting a box of your own, I will leave the information linked down below so you can go take a look for yourself. It is absolutely worth every single penny. All right, I'm gonna give you all first look. What do we have? Anything cool? Guess I can feel things underneath the tissue paper. Uh, to all who come to this happy place, welcome. Uh, if you're not familiar with that quote, it is by Walt Disney himself. As much as I hate ruining the stickers, I'm gonna cut this one so that I can get into the package quicker. So we've got beautiful yellow tissue paper. Oh, so there, there's a number of things in here. So usually there's just one envelope. Um, I cover up my last name there, but uh, you've got the Friends statue there uh, with Walt Disney and Mickey on its back. It says celebrate the magic, the memories, and circa 1955. So let's open this up. I'm pretty sure this is going to be the spoiler cheat sheet. I just want to make sure. Yep, it is. Okay, I'm going to set that aside here real quick. We've got two more envelopes. This one has a beautiful wax seal on the back. And this one has a Disneyland D with Celebrate the Memories. So, I'm going to very carefully open this one because this one is on top. Usually there's a method to how she packages things. So let's see if I can get this open. Really don't want to take and damage that wax seal because wax seals are so neat. They're so they're so uncommon nowadays. Um, I'm a big a bit of a history buff, so I love seeing those old school touches like the wax seals. Alright, we're just gonna get a little creative here. There we go. Get that last piece of tape for me. All right. Another Walt Disney quote. I only hope that we never lose the sight of one thing, that it was all started by a mouse. Oh, Nicole, you have outdone yourself. So when you open up the card, it's a 3D card and it has Mickey Mouse and then you've got the castle in the back. That is so cute. I'm guessing this must be a Disneyland themed box because this all looks like very much like Disneyland to me, but we'll see. I could be very wrong. That is absolutely fantastic. You've got Sorcerer Mickey there. I love that. Such a beautiful card. All right. Next up, you know, I'm just going to open this one the old fashioned way. There's no wax seal on it, just the sticker. So, okay. Yet another Walt Disney quote. Maybe this is Walt Disney themed. When you believe in a thing, believe in it all the way, all the way implicitly, words today are hard, and unquestionable. Uh, Walt Disney had one simple idea, creating a space where parents and children could have fun together. Here we are 66 years later, celebrating his park, the sights, sounds within it, and above all, the countless friendships and families who've been brought together from his idea. Let's take a moment and reflect on Walt and his vision. I want to share with you one of my all-time favorite photographs of him. I can't imagine the level of anxiety and excitement he had in the days leading up to the opening of this amazing place. Cheers to his perseverance and drive in making the dream a reality. We wouldn't be here without you, Walt. Oh, I love that. So you can see Walt Disney there. You've got the beautiful castle. That's a really pretty photograph. I love how that is done. I'm going to be hanging onto that and putting it up with um, the 
uh, Sleeping Beauty Castle that I've got um, that's a Funko Pop. All right, digging further, a little bit of tissue paper. We've got one. Ooh, good things come in small packages. Two, three, and four. Okay, so I know that in this box are the candles that are for the actual like subscription. So I'm gonna save this for last. Let's go over these. So sometimes she includes specialty candles. Um, I know for last month, month with Mary Poppins, there was a small little candle that she included that had, sorry, this is paper. Um, that was, there was like several different flavors that you could have gotten and they all had to do with the Mary Poppins theme. Oh, I can smell this candle even without opening. Let's see. It says, cheers to five years on the front. Ooh. So it's got a little bit of a clean scent. Um, smells a little bit like cherry. Hmm. I get a little touch of the, like, Pirates of the Caribbean water. If you, if you know, you know. That smells really good. All right. Little tiny box. I can hear something moving around inside of it. Oh. Did you know metal and enamel pins have been part of the Disney parks since Disneyland first opened in 1955? These Hidden Mickey cast member pins were donated by fellow magic, maker, magic makers. We hope you enjoy this little piece of home. Oh, this is so sweet. So we've got a Disney pin and it has Mickey on it. Um, this one is part of that Hidden Mickey set. Um, there's a little tiny Mickey head on it here near one of the corners. Um, they are a particular set you can get. A lot of times they come out for cast members. There's a whole slew of them. But that is super sweet that people um, sent in Disney pins for her to be able to use to spread the joy. I, I'm a Disney pin collector, so that's always an absolute blast. Uh, last, we've got a magnetic photo frame. It says there's no place like home, as well as some cute little notepads with the same title on top. These will definitely come in very handy around our house. Um, we love taking trips, so having a little photo frame like this is perfect. I can't wait till we're able to put a Disney photo in this. Uh, we haven't been able to go yet. And then sticky notes and notepads, are, they're always needed. Alrighty, let's get into this. Very last one. Let's see what Nicole said. I says, Jess, thank you for your loyalty and commitment to Circa 1955. We are so very grateful for you and have, hope you enjoy the experience. Cheers, Nicole. One of the things I love about Circa 1955, if you look, that's a handwritten note. Nicole takes and writes notes in every single uh, card that she sends with a box. And personal touches like that are really what makes a great company. Part of why I've stuck around. Um, here we are celebrating five whole years of circa 1955 boxes. Okay, so this must be like a Walt Disney, you know, celebrating just the magic of Disney box along with five years, which is incredible. They've been making boxes for five years. I never imagined I'd get to this point nor be able to build an amazing community of folks who love Disney as much as I do. Thanks to each and every one of you for supporting this little shop of mine and for celebrating with me. In this experience, we'll touch on the magic, the memories, and what makes this uniquely Circa. So unlock the magic and join us as we say cheers to five years. Awesome. Now, the, the one thing I really love about Nicole's boxes, other than, you know, hand touches and things like that, is that she does two candle scents. One is what's called an explorer scent. It has to do with a land a particular attraction, a ride, things like that. And then there's a sweet treat that goes along with it. So let's see if we can figure out what's what. And seriously, Nicole, your wrapping is just phenomenal. I wish I could have you come wrap all my Christmas presents because I'm absolutely and utterly hopeless when it comes to that. 
always hate destroying this beautiful paper that she finds. I don't know where she finds everything, but it's all perfectly themed to whatever she is including in the boxes. I absolutely love it. All right. Oh, I can already smell these. Ooh, okay. Oh, Nicole, you snuck this in on us. So usually there are two scents that come in tins like this. As you can see, these are not the same size. <laughs> um, with these, the um, candles usually are just plain like this in a little tin. It works perfectly. I have these scattered all over the house. But I'm thinking that this must be, let's see. I'm thinking this might be the Explorer scent. Let's try again. Okay, it says the Explorer. I wanted a fun and vibrant champagne type scent to celebrate our five year anniversary. Enjoy a fun blend of nectarine, berries, champagne, and currants. Okay, I can see how that could be champagne for sure. Definitely the berry scent to the nectarines. Awesome. So this must be our sweet treats, which I can smell vanilla coming off of this immediately. It's wonderful. Oh, how beautiful. So Nicole has sent us a beautiful full-size candle in this glass jar that has home on it in beautiful glittery lettering. And this one is called Main Street Marceline. I'm, I'm guessing this is the sweet treat of just by the name. There's nothing more magical than walking under the railroad bridge and exploring the sights, sounds, and smells of Main Street as we see that amazing castle at the end of the street. Yeah, this smells like walking into Main Street USA. You've got vanilla, You've got almost like, almost like a popcorn scent, if that makes any sense whatsoever. You've got kind of the caramels, the vanillas. It just, it smells like home. That's the best way to put it. It smells like home. Absolutely love this. I cannot wait to add this to my beautiful collection of candles. Well, there you have it, folks. Um, Circa's, Circa 1955's Cheers to Five Years box. I absolutely love this company and wholeheartedly recommend them as one of my favorite companies to buy candles from. Um, I've bought a few others over the years and Circa 1955 blows all of them out of the water. The scents are always on point, the customer service and just loving touches done by Nicole and her team are just fabulous. I can't, I can't say enough good things about Nicole and Circa 1955. They do also have candles that are not necessarily um, Disney themed. If you're more interested in that, they've got some other ones. I picked up a gingered peach recently that was oh, absolutely wonderful. Um, I've, I've almost burnt the entire thing and I picked it up like a month ago with that. So love the candles. They are just delicious. Um, they've got some Harry Potter ones out now. I think she's doing another subscription box with those or like an experience box. Um, you'd have to go look to be on the safe side. I don't remember exactly what she titled it. Um, they've got some Star Wars stuff. They've got just the other scents that they have, um, honeysuckle and uh, ginger peach, and there's, there's a numerous ones. Um, I will leave, like I said, the website down below. The parent company itself is called Luxa Lumen, and then the Circa 1955 is the um, subscription experience box. But like I said, I'll leave everything linked down below. You can check everything out for yourself. But uh, that's it for today's video. I'm glad you stuck around. I'm glad you watched me unbox this beautiful, beautiful box that I look forward to every single time it comes. Um, an email pops in my inbox saying that it's on its way. I look forward to seeing these. And I hope that you will go purchase from Nicole yourself and give everything a try. It's definitely worth the penny. All right, folks, I hope you have an absolutely magical day. Until next time.